Hello everyone, I am reading a hand of a person who is age 42, he is 1978 born and we would be reading his hand but before I start I would request you to press the bell icon on YouTube and don't miss another update. You, to get a paid palmistry reading from me you can call me or you can email me to get a paid palmistry reading. Now we straight away head to this particular hand reading. Uh, let us basically be, uh, start first just removing these uh, images out here and we would take up this particular hand image. So the image that we see out here, uh, the person is colored this particular hand image and uh, he's aged 42. So before I go into specifics, uh, we would look at the strength of the hand. The strength of the hand comes with the qualities that the person basically has and those qualities never go away. And qualities is a thing that brings success to the person and qualities if, if the person doesn't have those qualities the person is likely to be unsuccessful. So the main area, the main line in this particular hand in the present time is this particular line that you see not many people are going to be having this particular these particular lines of mercury and these are very independent kind of lines deep lines and clear lines there's a difference between clear lines and weak lines and feeble lines so these lines that we see are very strong kind of lines and strong kind of lines of mercury mercury planet is basically the planet for skill it is a small finger but small finger doesn't mean that uh, it has got weakness in it and it has got no quality the maximum quality that we uh, look for is in the little finger the pinky finger the mercury finger and if this area is is good then the chances is automatically good whatever bad signs there may be in the hand because the reason is the person is going to be using his communication skills and the calculations to come out of any problems i would just uh, show you what a basically a feeble line might look like in comparison to these deep and clear lines uh, the lines uh, the line that i am going to be depicting on depicting on is not the mercury line but i am just showing you this particular line in comparison to this particular line so i am just going to remove the uh, the lines i have drawn so that you can judge it for yourself that what it basically represents just notice this particular line this is the line of sun in comparison to the line of mercury these lines that you see are even un under the finger and these long kind of a line starting from the lifeline and continuing till the mount of mercury see uh, in uh, you must have heard and seen many videos where you must have seen and people are talking about a money triangle this even this particular hand has a very clear cut money triangle and uh, money triangle is formed with a combination of two or three lines and these lines are basically the combination of mercury line the line of finances the money line and basically the headline and these this money triangle is kind of pointing towards three fingers the finger of saturn saturn is the finger of wisdom that means wise decisions and realistic kind of decisions and uh, it is uh, Saturn is also the planet of money and possessions so automatically this particular quality comes to this particular person and this is the area of your creativity art music and uh, brilliance and this is the area of skills I have already talked about so what happens is that it is said that energies or rays penetrate the fingers and when they penetrate this particular palm out here when they penetrate the palm so these energies are going inside and they are kind of accumulating somewhere out here so what is happening is uh, the money line out here the age could be approximately i'm just going to remove all these lines so that we have a better idea 
So these these lines, the starting point of the money line. This is the starting point. So this is as somewhere at an early age, uh, probably somewhere from the age of 28 or so, things could have improved. But at the juncture of the money line and the headline, this is when the age is 35. This is when things might have gone wrong completely. Completely means completely things might have gone really bad for him because the main money line is ending and a new one is basically developing. So if there's a new one that has developed, it basically covers up for this particular break. And uh, one more thing you need to go back again and again to the positive aspects as well. If we find that the person has got skills, so imagine the person loses everything in life and any given moment of time, be it at 20 years when the person is 20 years or 35 or 45 or 55 or 60, the person is going to be useful if these lines are shown, are seen on a person's hand. So th this is a very, very positive aspect and uh, uh, do, uh, do try to understand that that one line means one skill, two lines mean two skills, three line means three skills. Generally, book says that if a person has got many independent lines over the amount of mercury, it represents that the person could be a doctor. But not necessarily, I would say not necessarily the person can be a doctor. It could mean just means that the person has got more than one set of skill. And more than one set of skill basically means that the person is going to be extremely good uh at all these kind of skills and is going to basically be able to do good in his life so uh so this is what uh is uh, i i we, i notice on uh, uh on, on this particular hand there are other good aspects as well a uh, backward line on the amount of jupiter jupiter is a big planet big planet basically means growth and expansion and this particular uh, line although this is starting at an early age from the lifeline going upward it would be fall all throughout the person's life it is not that it is only limited to one particular uh, time period and uh, this time period where it starts is early period in, in his 20s but uh, when the lifeline or the headline moves towards the amount of jupiter it means that the person is on the growth path and the person wants honor and the person lives for honor this is what the person is and uh, jupiter is a big planet it means expansion growth honor in one's life so th this is the positive aspect the other positive aspects is this v-like formation one uh, on the sun line and the sun line becomes much better beyond the heart line and between the fingers so this is the portion when the person is after the age of 30 uh, 53 that the line becomes much more stronger but common sense says that even uh, it doesn't like it doesn't happen that when you are when you are uh, when you reach a particular age only then you would get success uh, because it's not that it's suddenly everything comes to you the it is going to be a combination of all the lines in the palm that would indicate success or failure so if a person has got skills and the skills the person is sharpening on a day-to-day -day basis every day the person is sharpening the skills because of the strong line means that the person is sharpening the skills every day each and every day the person is learning something and improving upon uh, improving upon his skills and that is the reason why uh, at uh, at any age the person would never feel uncomfortable however the problem might be big this is also the area of your finances and this is the area of your calculations communications and this is the area of your science and all these kind of things so everything is basically intact even lawyers have these perpendicular and strong lines over the amount of amount of mercury so let me basically change over to some other hand image that he had sent me over so that i will try to indicate what i see on those particular palm i just take up another hand image that i had selected and uh, it is uh, let me just go through it i want to show you one particular indication that i did see on his palm and 
even then on his left fair, left palm you uh, you would see notice that a strong line of mercury strong line of sun which is a line of carrier so all these lines are uh, beautiful lines i'm just going to I, what i was trying to see was this is the lifeline and therefore there were a few small small lines pointing downwards towards the mount of moon i'm just find, trying to find that particular image and uh, i want the best image to be seen so that you know what i'm talking about let's take yes this is the image that we are referring to so uh so notice one thing that i'm just going to zoom in and this is basically the lifeline and you would notice you very very small kind of lines very small kind of lines pointing towards the mount of mercury and this is a long line that is going towards the mount of uh, sorry not new mount of mercury this is the mount of moon so it's pointing towards the mount of moon uh, any line moving upward towards a finger from the lifeline these are beautiful lines but any line pointing downwards towards the mount of moon these are basically negative kind of lines let me explain what i mean by negative uh, this basically these lines indicate that there could be few losses loss of health or loss of wealth health or wealth is go like going to go uh, from his hand and the age is somewhere the person is basically traveling and this is the approximate age where these few troubles can come about but it is all about the strength of the line the if the strength of the line is very very strong these strong lines it uh, if if these are weak lines then it would mean uh, the losses are going to be are going to be really marginal and if the line is very strong then basically the problem could be uh, could be major so uh, and uh, sometimes it is not just that the wealth goes away it could also mean that uh that the person loses weight he he mentions that uh he mentions that uh like uh, he's overweight so these lines that we uh, that we notice out here this could purely mean that the person loses weight loses weight body weight so it could also mean that these lines that that you see uh, downward kind of lines pointing towards the mount of moon these lines could also mean because when they are traveling towards the mount of moon moon is basically a, a planet that changes many phases every day a new phase is coming about so uh, what happens is that if the line moves towards the mount of moon it means that the person might get restless and the person would want to travel and the person would want to move about uh, and wherever the person goes even if the person goes to a foreign country or a different city or to hills or or to beaches the person is still going to feel that restlessness so this restlessness is going to come about uh, in this particular person's life but but again uh, i would say the same thing that strong lines over the mount of mercury this would basically save this particular person this is these are beautiful lines and the line of even the sun line the sun line is the carrier line if the person has got a strong carrier line it basically means that the person would always have a very very strong carrier so uh, so this is what ca can be seen now before i uh, continue with this particular video i will just add few things people generally want to know about money possessions and wealth the importance of money line in terms of how much money we will have is just 15 percent so you would notice that i have not talked much about the money line we can come to know about money from almost all aspects of your palm it can be your lifeline your heart line your mars area the venus area the mercury area and many more areas that i have might have missed out here right now uh, i repeat this thing almost uh, towards the end of the video but uh, right now i'm uh, saying this somewhere in the middle or towards the end but there's still more things to be said a saint once said to me you do not need to go to an palmist to 
know about your future because you already know your future present is a result of past how will be my future future depends upon what you are doing in the present what are we we are product of our thoughts so the thoughts that come to our mind are really important keep positive thoughts and keep good company because this is what basically matters and nothing matters any uh, uh, more than that and uh, let me just uh, show you his uh, money line uh, although I, I said that money line has got less important but still I would say it has got immense importance and uh, uh, I just mark the age this is early period from somewhere at the age of uh, 28 onwards and it touches the line of head so it ends on the headline it does it does continue a little bit but this is a weak kind of weak kind of a line so it has got less importance then we would notice that the line is like continuing out here starts from the headline so age 35 it starts and then it continues and it kind of has got a wave like formation out here you would notice and then basically it straightens up and goes straight towards the apex of the saturn mount what is basically the apex of the saturn mount this is you would know that this is these are these uh, skin pattern out here so this is the skin pattern i'm not talking about the lines i'm just talking about the skin pattern and this is the apex one of the apex of the jupiter mount is somewhere out here of the mercury mount is somewhere out here so the, we are talking about the skin pattern and you would notice that it is going straight towards the mount of saturn and this is all happening after the age of 53 so a line so let me again draw from the age of 35 onwards it kind of moves and then it straightens and curves towards the mount of saturn so if this particular portion of the line had continued somewhere out here so it would have gone somewhere towards the mount of jupiter and jupiter is basically not for money because the line curves there's a there's a curve in the money line and going straight away and heading towards the mount of saturn and saturn is basically for money possessions wealth responsibility money management materialistic outlook and good management of money and uh, resources so this is what comes about more in this particular person's life after the age of 53 so more money is going to come about because of a very very strong and clear-cut deep and clear line of a line of saturn or the line of fate or whatever you can call it there's also a v like portion that that we see somewhere at this particular age so if this is this point is age 35 and this point is age this is 53 and this is age 35 so somewhere in the middle it's basically age 44 so he could be somewhere out here uh, uh, so uh, so what happens is that this is this is where the person could be or even this line cut so there could be few problems but beyond that there's no problem and then there's a V like portion so somewhere at the age of uh, let's say 48 or so uh, money line and in combination with the sun line it gives result uh, I just go back to the sun line you'd notice that the sun line is not so prominent out here this is early period so it is not that you need to have all the lines to be the best even if you have one or two lines that is basically good enough so uh, so uh, what I wish to say is that uh, I basically segment the sun line into three parts. The uh, like so I subdivide the sun line into three: deep clouds, light cloud, and no cloud. So when there are deep clouds, it means that the line is extremely dim. It means that the person is doubtful and the person doesn't know what, where the person wishes to go. Uh, although uh, the sun line is uh, very weak, but yet uh, I would say even during the period from early period onwards, still the person would have got result because of the strong mercury line. So uh, it is uh, it is not that if you have got a weak sun line it doesn't mean that there would be no success at all so but still if you have if the person does have a clear-cut sun line it adds up to success 
So when they are light clouds, light cloud means that the line is visible but not so clear. So you would notice that the line is visible out here but it's not so very much strong. So it means light cloud. Light clouds mean basically sometimes there are clouds in, in the sky and sometimes there, there are no clouds. It means sometimes your work becomes better and sometimes it doesn't give as much uh, a, a good result. Then we come to the last thing that is no clouds in the sky. No clouds in the sky is this particular portion after the age of 53. It means that when there are no clouds in the sky, the sun is shining bright and because the shining, sun is shining bright uh, on earth, there's lots of sunshine and the uh, plants are growing much faster because of the sunlight they get. You put a plant in sunlight, it's going to grow much faster. If you keep the plant in shade, then it's not going to grow as much at a much faster, faster pace. So uh, that is why sunlight is important. And uh, some people might say that these lines are lines of uh, name and fame. Yes, I would say that these are lines of name and fame. But at the same time, it is purely and purely or, or they would say that th this is the line of luck. I, I don't say that these lines, lines are, for, are of luck. It is purely and purely how much energies you are giving to your work. So if you are giving great amount of energies to your work, it means it means that it's going to shine. If there are weak kind of lines, if the person has got very weak kind of lines, these kind of lines, these are basically lines of doubts. And I've just drawn it for... Uh, your informational purpose but uh, representational purpose and it's not that the person has got these weak lines out here out here uh, it, the person does have weak lines in the earlier period but it becomes strengthens at the later period in in the person's life so uh, and, and other part is it's common sense that if a person has got good lines after the age of 50 it doesn't mean that the that the luck is going to shine suddenly and everything is going to turn around for him. The person needs to be working throughout their life. It's only when the person, that's when the person gets success. And the person is surely going to be extremely, extremely, extremely successful. This is a very, very good hand to have. Good Venus is present. So good amount of energies is going to be uh, there in his, in his life. The strong line that we see uh, out here, it, it would take away far away from his birthplace or far away from his family, somewhere at a later stage in his life, probably somewhere at the age of 60, 65 or so. And, uh, and that's it for out here. Thanks for watching. One last thing is that the heart line is ending close to the Mount of Saturn. It means that the person is... Uh, good at managing money it's kind of curving also it means that the person is passionate and display of emotions is there and uh, i normally correlate the heart line for success also if the heart line is deep and clear singular kind it means uh, more focus and uh, heart line ending on the mount of saturn brings the quality of saturn the old man whatever old man has quality so old man knows the importance of money so they care about the money and they basically kind of uh, keep money for uh, difficult times. Thanks, bye and take care. Before I end, press the bell icon on YouTube. Don't miss another update. To get a paid palmistry reading, call me or you can email me. Bye, take care.